Hey guys, I hope you're hungry. Welcome back to Kingdom Hearts here on the Full and Sons channel. My name is Jericho. In the last episode, we defeated the guard armor and made, you know, real progress towards cleansing Traverse Town of the Heartless, although we are not quite done here yet. We will be back. But for now, it is time for the first time to truly set sail on the gummy ship out into the wide world that is Kingdom Hearts. I love the music so much. Observe the battle level when selecting donations. More strongly, stronger, heartless. Okay, so I still haven't really decided where I want to go. The game wants you to do Wonderland first, but I don't like it as much, and I, I do enjoy doing Tarzan first, but I think I will just go ahead and do Wonderland first, kind of just to get it out of the way. Um, as far as building a new gummy ship, um, I will do it, but probably off screen. Actually, it might be a cool thing to stream, possibly. Um, but that won't be for a while yet. Um, just because it's kind of useless until, um, until you have, like, all the gummy parts. Like, like I'll, I'll, I'll do parts as I get them. Like, like, if I, if I get, you know, like, a, like a good, um, a good cannon, I'll get it to, um, add it to, um, my ship. Just to make it easier. But it'll just, like, like, throw it on there. Like, not a full redesign. And then maybe, like, late game, like, like before I do the last journey, uh, I'll bust out whatever, like, redesign I'm able to do. So all these pieces I'm getting, though, Protect G and all that, they're all pieces for the gummy ship where I can, I can um, redesign. And I won the race, so it's, it's going to be called um, Slave 1 instead of Highland. I typically do rename it Highland, um, but I think the game often does. I don't know if I've ever won the race in the story, so I actually don't know if it's going to name it Slave 1 or High Winds, um, but it usually defaults to High Wind. I don't know if it will since I actually won the race, but um, I often leave it as High Wind just in tribute to Riku because he won, I guess it's only fair sort of thing, but I don't know. I should have won. So the controls are inverted, which I'm not particularly good at. I mean, I know it makes sense more so for, for um, flight, flight sense sort of things like this than um, basically anything else, but it's still not something I'm best at, and it's like a little bit finicky. A lot of people really don't like the gummy ship, but it's fun. It's, it's like interesting. I'm glad you don't just like teleport from world to world. I think it's clever enough, um, although it does suck like doing the same thing again and again. I think you don't get to warp for a little while, and that, that's a big pain. So, here we are at Wonderland. So this is how Kingdom Hearts works. If you're unfamiliar with it, you go to the Disney World and you usually interact with um, more or less the story that happened in the movie. Wonderland is, is quite quite different, um, especially compared to Deep Jungle, which is basically similar. Well, I don't know. I guess none of them are, are, are all that close. But you meet the same characters and the same villains and stuff like that. Oh, my favorite missus! I'm late, I'm late, I'm late! Now, I, it's important to me. I don't, I don't ever use walkthroughs during my Let's Plays. I have consulted it between episodes from time to time, but I don't, like, pull it up. And I don't want to do it with this, but um, this is, like, a sort of a tricky world in some ways. Like, like if you want to really get everything and do the best you possibly can with it, um, it's a bit difficult. There's a really cool keychain you get here. Um, I think you have to come back much later to get it. That's something I'll, I'll, I'll uh, consult a walkthrough to find. It's called the Divine Rose, and it's one of my favorite um, keyblade designs. How did he get so small? You're too big. Uh, no, you're simply too big. I like the music here, too. Well, thanks! Must you be so loud? You woke me up. <sighs> Good morning. Good night. I need a bit more sleep. I love you so much. Wait, what do we have to do to grow small? Try the Why bottle. Why don't you try the bottle? I don't like how well I know this, but oh, well I also there. love how well I know this. So. so just like in Alice in Wonderland, one makes you bigger, one makes you smaller. And there are some things you can only do in this room when you're big, and some things you can only do if you're small. And that basically applies to um, every room in Wonderland. Changing both your size and the orientation of the room uh, is paramount to success in this world. 
level up for Donald. I equipped some items off screen. I gave the, um, I can't remember, it's like the Brave Warrior or something like that to, um, that is crazy, two spirit shards. Um, okay, so this is our first time seeing these enemies. I believe these ones are red operas, so they use magic. Uh, if you use fire against them, it heals them, but if you use blizzard against them, it doesn't even want it, does double damage, and you get tech points. So that's definitely the best way to finish them, especially since physical attacks don't do as much. The little uh, bubble looking things increase your MP. So this pink box up here, you need um, in the story, but I don't think there's a possible way for me to get it right now. I think there's more things I could have, should have, would have done when I was big, but I'll certainly be back. Wonderland is actually small in a lot of ways. Like there's, okay, yeah, I, I have to do it now. I have to get big and then small again. But you can't do it when you're first big, so it's just how it is. Like there's only like five rooms in Wonderland, but <clears throat> this room, whichever door you enter it in, it changes its orientation, like upside down, like left side down, all that stuff. So that's how they get, you know, a lot out of it. And there's a relatively tricky um, event battle, <laughs> if you want to say that you can kind of sweeten your odds by doing, you know, a, a good amount of ex exploring um, in the world. But, um, I don't, I don't know what I was going to say. <laughs> it can be difficult to kind of keep that straight. Come on. Like, which way you're supposed to go for what? Okay, it's interesting like despite what the doorknob said you really are giant because the heartless only appear when you're small Oh, the event battle is made easier with fire. That's what I was going to say. I'm just going to let the scene play out and not comment too much if I can help it. Court is now in session! I'm on trial? But why? Her Majesty, the Queen of Hearts, presiding. Ah. Uh. <laughs> this girl so is the culprit. There's no doubt about it. And the Wonderland reason is pretty is short now that I think about I it. So, like, it figuring out so how unfair. to enter the room in the right way to do what well, you need to do you is like, anything to say as well as making it most of the map, it makes up most of the puzzle and challenge. Of course. I've done absolutely nothing wrong. You may be queen. Like, I would say maybe I'm only two episodes, unless right I, I struggle with so it more than I imagine. Silence! You dare defy me? Hey guys, we should help her out. We're outsiders, so wouldn't that be muddling? Oh yeah, <laughs> and that's against the rules. So this is weird, like they bring the it up, finds the but he meddles, we meddle in every single charged. world we go to. For the um, crimes of assault and, 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 it, and attempted just, theft of my it's heart. It's not that big a deal. <gasps> Off with our heads! No, no! Oh please! Hold it right there! Who are you? But not only goofy are right with you us. interfere with my them. court. Excuse me, but we know who the real culprit is. Uh huh. It's the heart one. Anyway, she's not the one why, you're looking for. I don't know why Goofy does that. Nonsense. Have you any proof? Why are they not supposed to know the name of them? Or like, I guess that would be worse meddling. Okay, so this is how it works. We need to gather evidence for Alice's guilt. There are a total of five pieces of evidence that are presented. We can find four Heartless evidence, and then the Queen will provide one Alice evidence. Well, it's either... Like, if we did nothing right now, there would be five boxes. One of Sora, one of Donald, one of Goofy, one of both of them, one of Alice, something like that. What happens is, if you end up with, um... If you are... 
if um, Donald or Goofy and or Goofy are in the evidence box, they get locked away and you don't have their help with the event battle unless you free them, which isn't the end of the world. But you can increase your odds of that not happening at all by finding evidence. I don't know if I'm going to find every piece, but I'll always find maybe two or three. If I found three, it would be enough to have better than even odds of, um, of it being, of a heartless being what we open. So, I mean, whatever. And it's never going to be perfect. Even if you find all four, you have a 20% chance. So. Ooh, indeed. Poor Alison to lose her head and she's not guilty of a thing. Eh. So he's going to give us our clue. They've already left the forest. I won't tell which exit. There are four pieces of evidence in all. Three are a cinch to find. Forest is tricky. Big reward if you find them all. Is there a reward? Maybe he might be implying that um, they haven't exactly left the forest, huh? Um, he might be implying that um, like we'll definitely have the help, but I think you do get another present. So let's just find out four. Why not? So in this forest, um, these flowers want items and stuff. Do I have any? Let's check. Oops. Yes, I do. And they always, it's always good to do this. Here. Like he'll probably give me an elixir instead, which heals my magic. Oh, a camping set. So a camping set is like the cottage, but I think it's even better where it heals all your HP and MP. I think I said you can only use those on save points. That's not true. You can use them only from the main menu outside of the battle. So I don't know if that was the best trade I've ever made. Uh, I mean, like, I guess so. An after it can heal three MP in battle versus all the HP and MP of the party out of battle. Push will make you bigger. I don't think we want to be bigger yet. I think there's more that we can do um, with the room as it is. We'll definitely have to get bigger soon enough. So Lucid Shard, like the... Um... Lucid Shard, like the Spirit Shard, is used for the... Um... Okay. So yeah, I'm going to just keep exploring while I'm small, and then we'll... Oh. I love fire. But you exhaust it quickly, and I'm used to playing um, as choosing the magic rod and denying the shield, so I'm, I'm, I'm stuck with less MP than I'm used to. Give me an ether. I think I just squandered my only ether. Oops. Keep doing that. Yep. So, you'll have to wait. Hopefully we'll come across one. Actually, I forgot to check. Maybe Donald or Goofy have one. Oh. They would surely have used one. Okay, so this is our first piece of evidence already. So, like, literally the least bit of effort will get you some of them. There are a lot of battles in Wonderland. That's one thing that makes it a little bit annoying. So this block leads to one of the only other locations. Like, we've basically seen the whole thing. There's this forest, the room with the doorknob, the courtyard and the tea room. That's it. Like the, the tea party area, I should say. Come on. I know I can make that. But that is fr the frustrating thing about the platforming in this game. Is some you can't, but they're like until you have high jump or glide, but it's not signposted. I knew I could get that. I think this is puppy. The first foundation are home. Nope. A scan gummy for our gummy ship. So that's fairly useful. I actually don't remember what it does. I'm assuming it's like a little radar of the enemy ships, which is pretty cool. Okay, this is how I get small once I'm big. There we go. Three puppies are now safe at home, so that is a most wonderful. I know there's an area around here that you have to jump up. Yes. So we got lots of presents in here. So there's another piece of evidence already. So two down. And 
and then we can do this Trinity Mark. I think it just gives like a bunch of money and stuff. Potion. I wouldn't mind if this one of these others is an ether so that we can trigger that other flower. There we go. Too much to hope for that it was equipped. Oh, I actually need that. Okay. What would you like? A potion. Why not? This should help. <laughs> More MP, now I'm full, and a high potion. So just a, a straight upgrade um, in addition to um, fully healing the MP. I am not going to engage. I don't want to risk falling. Okay, so here's three already. We only have one more to find, so we'll definitely stick through. I skipped what that was. That's probably, I think it's stench. There's foot, footprints on antenna, stench, and something else. I think that's all we can do from here, though. There's a Trinity Mark we can't access yet. I feel in my bones that we're gonna have combat soon. I know there's more that you can do while you're big in here, but I don't think we can do it yet. I think we have to have already done the little event thing. If I find the other um, piece soon, I might just, um, I might cap off the episode with the event battle, but if it takes a while, it might be the beginning of the next. So I think we explored pretty good. Oh wait, what do you want? A potion to make you bigger. Let's go ahead and do this. Here. Okay, so with that down, Okay. I actually think that's all we can do. There is a, a rock somewhere, but I don't think we can get to that part of the forest from here. It's more than stuffy again. I recorded so many episodes with that, like, head cold, um, I don't know, whatever nastiness I had, and then I thought I was over it. Oh, wait. We opened up this way. This is a lot easier than I remember. Probably because... I've mostly played this game as a child, and now I have my fully grown genius adult room. Okay, so now we can get up here. This will be a different way to enter the bizarre room, I believe. Yes. Will probably lead to the last piece of evidence. Yes, there it is. Okay. Donald, please get out of my way. I thought for sure Donald was going to screw me on that one. Claw marks, that's the last one. Thank you. Oh, look what you found. Nice going. Oh, I can save Alice. Don't be so sure. Maybe it's What about you? Oh, we learned Blizzard. That's not the only way to get Blizzard, though. So I don't know exactly what's going on with that. But Blizzard is, you know, of course, powerful, useful magic attack. That might come in handy in this. Right. Well, even though that was relatively quick, I think we'll go ahead and wrap up today's episode once I get back to the save point. And then the next episode we will begin with um, the reconvening of the court. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed today's episode, make sure you subscribe to the Full Ensemble channel. We have new episodes of Kingdom Hearts every Monday and Friday, but there's content on the channel every single day. So if you weren't so much into this, maybe come back tomorrow and see if there's something else you like. How about you guys? But I'm full.